Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Neon Jacket and welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be playing a game called World Zero and it is a game for Roblox. Now, this is like a MMO type game and I am a big fan of MMOs. Uh, so as you can see I have played a little bit of it. I've started and I've gotten through the first world. Honestly, I must say it's it's pretty fun. It's pretty cool. I like it so far and I see a lot of cool things that higher level that people are wearing and using in mounts and stuff so it's pretty exciting so let's go ahead and make ourselves a character now you start off with these three you got your sword master your arcane mage and your defender i've played the arcane mage tons of fun highly suggest it all of these characters right here the elementalist mage of light dual wielder everyone else beneath that you can earn in game by doing all the quests and stuff so each world you'll do have different quests that'll allow you to buy and purchase and unlock the other classes for you to play obviously you can also use robux and spend it that way but that's just your choice now i think what we're going to do is possibly play a defender i feel like that's gonna be what we're going for so let's go ahead and hop into the customizer yep we're gonna be tall because we want to be tall or should we be short be a little yeah we're just, we're just gonna be tall uh, doesn't look any oh they're up there wow those don't look like eyebrows are too high up go with those i'm not too uh, i'm all right with the eye colors i'm all right with the shape now his hair color yeah, let's make it bright, and then the hairstyle, let's see here. They do have a decent selection of hairstyles. Mostly, it looks like for women, for girls, but, I mean, there aren't bad hairstyles for guys. That kind of looks like a Link from Zelda. Just a little tanner. We're just going to go with this. Yeah, alright. Give them a nice little smile. Let's see. Do they not have a, a decent smile? They have these. I don't know if I want them to have shark teeth, though. They have that one. Yeah, there we go. Make ourselves a little Prince Charming. There we go. Alright, there's our character. And we also get to choose a pet. And you're able to level up these pets as you kill things. They can drop food, and you can level the pets up. And they look different as you go. Uh, now, I feel like we are going to go either boar wolf or a fox. I think we should do... Let's do the boar wolf. Yeah. Alright. We got our first pet. We got our class. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. As you can see, there's a logo for if you would like to play it. And if you can't find it, that's what you need to look for. All right, so up here, as you can see, defeat five boar wolves. That is our current and active quest. Down here, you can see our abilities on our hotbar, our health, experience, as well as our level is down here. On the side, we have our frame. If we press tab, you can open it for some more buttons. And these right here pretty much just use your, uh, your coins, these three. You just use your money, buy Robux, yada yada, you know. Uh, playlist everything else uh, the quests you can see in here each quest that you have to do and then at the very end it says go to world 2 by using the teleporter by completing all of these honestly very straightforward and easy you get rewards throughout doing it all and right here the class tickets that was what I was telling you at the beginning to buy the other classes you go in here and you can spend those class tickets because those were tier two so we'd be able to buy any one of those one of these three uh, you can get all three I assume if you were to just play on each character and get the amount you could buy each one of them and play them um, other than that you just keep going and I assume each level you're able to play these now these down here you have to prestige and that just gets 
that just entails getting up to level 110 and then you can prestige and you can play these the summoner looks really cool i've seen someone play that definitely something i would shoot for because i'm an mmo i have an mmo obsession to say the least so we're just gonna go ahead uh let's see what our abilities are e okay so there's like a little shockwave for e what's r okay i like that like in the aoe all right see that donut that's exactly what we're looking for when it comes to food there's also a uh, there's ice cream stuff like that and once you get that you're able to go in here feed pet and feed it and then as you can see evolution two percent out of a hundred now if we get that to a hundred he will go from looking all gray and shabby like these dudes and change colors and eventually you know he'll look pretty cool there's also a whole bunch of pets you can earn just by doing the quests and going to different worlds uh, so yeah it's honestly seems like a really in-depth game which excites me now as we complete our first quest we got ourselves an upgrade on weapon we're using now this pretty cool looking hook I like it it's like a hook sword that's cool and our next objective is to play a dungeon so we can go here that shows you all the loot that you can possibly earn and I'm gonna just hit find party you can do it solo it scales to your level well, you have like a level range you want to be around to do it so there's that but we're just gonna wait and see if uh, it doesn't look like we're gonna get anyone to help us so it will just be us in this dungeon which is not a bad thing it is more than alright I'm not too worried about it because all of this seems like you can solo anything and everything you want to um now one thing about MMOs that pretty much all MMOs have are raids and I'm very curious to see at the max level if there are things that would be considered as a raid because I mean if so then I feel like this would be a very a very good Roblox game and props to the devs let's see we're just gonna do some of this stuff this is what I was doing on the characters that I made to just you know test out and see how I like the game um, and I would just round up all the creatures and then just do huge AoE numbers on them and it's just so satisfying it's it's awesome they took his cabbages oh no all right dude let's go get your cabbages back poor cabbage merchant just just wanted his, his cabbages so here, let's demonstrate. There's one crab, two crab, three crab, four crab, and five crab. And we're just gonna kind of do a little dance to to corral them all together. Just do a little dancey dance, and then shaplop, bam, bam, bam. Yep, it's like a it gives me a Diablo type feel. That's what it reminds me of. Because in Diablo, that's all you do. Get you know rank uh, get those the the number because it scores you attracts each kill so you just score up keep going climb those numbers these two cans though I'm pretty sure these dudes hurt a decent bit they also have some okay health but we can handle it we did good All right, Just tree falling down. Got it. Cool. That's how that works. We kill a few birds and a, a crab, I think it was, and then automatically a tree just falls down. It's just amazing, ain't it? It's crazy how this world works. All right, come on, people. Got places to be and things to kill. You're on that list. Ah, see the Sunday. That's what we like seeing. Yeah, you just wait out here, buddy. I got this handled. Don't you worry. <clears throat> no. Alright then. Sweet. Got some uh, some bombs from a crabage. 
I guess it's cabbage crab. Cab crabbage. I'm just gonna go in here all berserk like. Do another E. Yeah. Sword slam slash slash slash. We got a got a nice little combo going on. I don't like the bombs. Hey, look at that. All this money. Yeah, we like that. And then the loot that you actually get will come right now. You can select one of two if you have the premium membership, which is just pretty much 1,800 Robux. You can unlock both. Um, but I have. Uh, I don't think I necessarily need nor want that right this moment. So, yeah, we're just going to go ahead and open the one and continue. I'll go ahead and return to the town so we can do the next mission and try and get to the second world as quickly as possible. Let's go ahead and see. Uh, give the pet a name. What should we name him? Borington. That's what his name will be. We got upgrade armor. It looks a little light. I mean, I thought we were a plateware. It just looks a little thin not much defense so we're just going to navigate to the next area see what we need to do um, well it looks like we need to kill 10 snakes that's exactly what it looks like we need to do all right look at that snake fields we've made it I'm just gonna round up a whole bunch of them cuz why not at least four or five of them. Uh, one, two, three, so maybe six. No, those guys went back. We're just gonna do these four. Cause the other guys, I guess they were ran too far away from their, their spawn, so they didn't want to come party. Such a shame. That's all right, we'll have a separate party for them. Hey buddies, I know you missed out. Don't worry, I'll fix your issues. That guy didn't want to tag along either. Lord, they have a very, very low, like, tether to their spawn location. I only need three more snakes, and then we'll be good to go. I believe the next mission is another dungeon. It seems to alternate most times. Um, there are also more than just these main dungeons. It's just each world has its own amount of quests that you have to complete to go unlock the next. But there are also these. There are world bosses that spawn. There's weekly quests. And then there's side quests that can get you certain things. Like, uh, let's see. Like this right here. Defeat the King Crab, which is a world boss. Five times, and that gives you a little crown for a cosmetic. It's just the little details, you know. Alright, we're gonna claim that. Oh, there we go. Now that's some armor. That's what I'm talking about. That looks a little beefier. That's good. Alright, dungeon two. Let's just go ahead and start it, because I don't think we will be getting any people to join us. Not and make it easier. I do believe this is the crow dungeon, and this one was a little annoying, but it, it'll be alright. I'm not worried about it. Yeah, it is. It is indeed the crow one. Well, it's just me. There isn't anyone else. But yeah, I'm here to help. I'll defend your scarecrows. Or I'll... No, I'll kill the scarecrows. No. Yeah, I'll defend the scarecrows. I'll kill the crows. Lord, this is confusing. Too many crow talk. Just knock all these out. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Alright. Where are they coming from next? Over here? And over there. Alright. No over there? That's good. I also got a cobra. Don't like snakes. 
especially not the ones that are trying to knock down my scarecrows, no siree. I don't really mind snakes in general if they're just chilling, but like, if they're in my house or, well, trying to hurt me or someone I care about, then yeah, it's an issue. Come on, crow. Thank you. I just wanted your death. I'm getting a whole bunch of gold, that's for sure. I already had a thousand. Got 15 more to kill. One, two, three, they're coming from all sides. I don't know why I couldn't hit him right there. That was, uh, maybe it's because he was, like, doing his little charge-up type thing. Maybe that. I don't really know. We'll see. No, I guess it was just, like, a weird little bug. No telling. We gotta go protect our others. Yeah, see, I like that. That type of stuff's just too satisfying for me. I can't pass it up. It's just... It's nice. Just watching all that big group disappear in a few seconds. It's cool. I like it. Alright, boss time. He has to come out of this. It just makes sense. Yeah. Come on, buddy. I missed. Yeah, all he's all he wants is okay there we go. I was about to say all he's going for is the scarecrow, that's not helpful. I was supposed to protect him. This dude see it's not bad whenever the bosses are doing mediocre damage. As long as you can out damage the boss, that's all that matters. That's as much as you need to do. As well as be able to survive as long as the boss, you know, takes hits. That part, too. Uh, we did, I think, that one last time. So let's go with this one. That's another green. If only we could get something better. But at least it's an upgrade. That's what matters. Go ahead, return back to the town. Now it wants us to go over and defeat a le or 15 uh, boar wolves. So we're just going to go here. I believe I unlocked the portal on the way. No, I did not. Okay, so we're just going to have to run. Yeah, it's a, it's a little distance, but that's all right. We also got an egg that we could hatch. I, I kind of want to save the food, though, and then spend it on him. Um, so that's what I think we're going to do. If we go over to side quests, yeah, alright, there's not much really we could do, we could just get a little bit of XP for free, oh, right here, look, defeat dungeon, die a problem at any difficulty, level too low, that's nice, I have to be level 7, alright, we're pretty much there, we'll get that the next, uh, next level. And then that will help us, and we'll just use that all on Borington, get him leveled up and get him to his next phase, and see what he looks like. I really enjoy the sense of, like, excitement whenever something's supposed to change and, you know, you're working hard, like, you're working on it to get it to change and do better, because I believe it, it also, once you, like, evolve it, it upgrades their ability, which is number one. See, all it has is bite right now. Once it levels up, it could change into something else, and it will do more damage. And that, it's helpful. You know, you gotta do more damage if you want to progress. And progression is what, at least I like. I like progression. So we're just gonna kill up some of these boar wolves. I will cut back whenever we got all of them killed. Go get the food, little dude, Mr. Borington. Now one thing that this MMO game does not have that most do is, like, your own personal skills. Obviously you have your own skills that are designed for your class. 
and that are for your class, but you don't upgrade your skills. You, I, from what I understand, you use the same skills. Well, maybe not. It looks like there's a lot more skills for this guy than there is on uh, any other one that I well, than I thought or saw before. That's what I'll say. All right, we did it. Oh wow, got a nice upgrade for our weapon. Wow. All right then. Yeah, 56. Look at that. That was nice. Okay, I'm about to die. Again. That's not what I want. We're gonna do this and run away. There we go. Beautiful. We're just gonna do the dungeon. Ignore that. Continue moving forward. Get to world two. Alright, now we're fully loaded in, so I want to check how much food I actually have, just so I can keep track. I, I We'll wait until after uh, this dungeon, and then we'll feed them. It went that way. Alright, so we're going to be fighting wolves. Yeah, wonderful. Alright, boar wolf, uh, we're going to fight your own kind for a while. Sorry, not sorry, dude. Sorry, not sorry. We're just gonna pull all of them and see how well this goes. I'm going in confident. Going in confident. That wasn't too bad, honestly. Look at that. Well done, well done. Good job, Borington. You did great. I'm proud of Mr. Borington. There's the dude we're fighting. Ah, rude. Invisible barrier no longer. See, the dungeons are... They're honestly quite short, which is pretty nice. I like that the dungeons are also required in the actual like quest line of the game because I feel like dungeons are uh, a good part of MMOs when they have them. I really enjoy dungeons and pretty much all in every MMO I've played the dungeon is what I enjoyed most. Alright we got a lot of dudes to fight here let's do it. Come on one come yeah hold up come one come all that's that's the right way to say it. We're just gonna get everyone. Come on, people. Look at this. I got a beautiful number. And bam. Just like that. They're pretty much all dead. Just two remain. There we go. Beautiful. Got a few Sundays, I do believe. Yeah, we did. We got two, I think. Oh, nice. Thanks for dropping a boulder. It's very convenient. I really appreciate it. It helps out a lot. Oh, no. Oh, it just stuns you. Oh, crap. It does reset you down to the bottom. Ooh, no, don't hit me. Dear. Oh, Lord. I swear I didn't have this much... Uh, trouble the first time I ran up this dungeon. I'm just gonna have to play it smart and safe. Just go with the ball. Just roll with it. Get it. Because, you know, the boulder's rolling. I'm gonna wait until that passes and then run. Stay on the side. Yeah! Oh, How cute! Did a little, uh, poot explosion. Where were the boulders coming from? Go get him, tiger. You know you're a boar, but, you know, you're a champion. I like how they don't help fight aside from just the attack that you have them use. It's honestly kind of inconvenient. Get away from that. That's the bad one. Bam. Chop, chop, chop. Yeah. 
I'm sure you don't like this. This isn't what you wanted to deal with, I'm sure. But, you know, we didn't want to deal with a, a dire boar wolf with horns. So we, you're just inconvenient and we're trying to... Ev this is your eviction notice officially. Finish him off, Borrington. Yeah, that's what we like. I like it when they die. Look at that. We did great. Look at you, Mr. Borrington. A little sidekick. I'm just gonna go back and forth. Another green. I swear, I'm not getting any luck with the colors. But it's an upgrade. Back to the thin stuff. At least it's an upgrade. I swear. Alright, let's see. Let's see. Level 8. I don't know. What is going on there? That was interesting. Let's see. Cancel. 150 health. I can upgrade it. Rough skin and bonus walk speed. 353 health. I guess. I guess we'll wear it. Let's see. Defeat two cans in the forest. And look, we're gonna use our, our, our waystone. We're just gonna. Our waystone over there. Snake farm, and then from the snake farm, we gotta run past those boars. So we gotta go over there behind that ship. <laughs> Completed a daily quest. There we go. We got the 25. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, so let's get to. We'll just stop right here and feed Mr. Borrington. We're gonna go to our inventory. Oops. Press on all of the wrong buttons. Go to. Oh, my lord. Calm down, Cobra. This ain't about you. Oh, they're just gonna keep respawning. I have to move. We're gonna run over here. We're just gonna go to the Waystone now, because that's apparently the only place I'm not gonna be bothered by anything. Maybe right here, actually. I'll just... Nope. What about up here? On, on the boat. What about this? This looks safe. Alright. Be up here. We're just gonna go to Feet Pit. One, two, three, start out with the small stuff first. That's what we're going to do. And we're just going to feed it all the way up to 100%. And he should then change. He'll change his appearance and he'll look completely different. Do more damage. Have a different ability. Max, he's evolving. Alright. see what color he is. Oh, he got bigger and he's brown. Okay, we're going to keep feeding him. We're going to keep going until we can't go no more. That's what this is going to do. Looks like we're just going to make it to his third stage. Nice. Alright, he's honestly pretty sizable. That's not, that's not that bad. He looks cool. I like him in his white form. That's nice. And he heals? Is that what his ability? Heal pulse. Yes, it is. Wow. Alright. That'll be helpful. I gotta kill these dudes now. Voila. No. I don't need a level 44 just killing all of the toucans. Dang it. Ugh. This is not okay. Not okay whatsoever. At least they respawn quick. Well, I'll, we have to kill uh, 13 more, so I will cut back to whenever we have all of them killed, and hopefully it won't take too long with this uh, level 44 running around taking all dang two cans. Alright, we just need one more, and then we are good to go. There's one right here, so we're just gonna go over here and, you know, do a little slammy slam and then a little slashy slash. And there we go. Got another weapon upgrade, level 9, instead of a level 7. We'll go with it because it's, well, it's an upgrade. Defeat crabs, okay. We have to kill some more crabs. There's the waystone that we are gonna go grab real quick, though, because that will be useful for the traveling, uh, times because I don't want to keep running everywhere or well, whatever's up there look it must be pretty cool because that looks pretty cool honestly the world isn't that like extravagant or extravagant mind you um 
That's pretty cool though. I like that castle. It looks like there's a, a hand holding it as well. So that, 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 that right there is pretty cool. I like it. We're just going to go ahead and kill up 16 more crabs because that is what we need. It's a hefty amount, but I'll just bring it back whenever uh, they're all killed up. So yeah. Oh, all right, look at that. The Crab Prince will arrive soon, and he's just right up there. So what we'll do is we'll finish off the last three crabs, and then we will run up there and kill him. Now, I wonder if the crabs that spawn with that boss counts. Not like it matters. I'm just gonna, uh, I'm just gonna kill the, these crabs anyways while we wait, because he won't spawn until that whole bar has been filled. So we got some time. And this is the last crab anyways, so bam, look at that, claim. Next up should be a dungeon, yes it is. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to wait for this dude to spawn, we're going to knock him out, get some gear, and go from there. We did get a Sunday while uh, I was just killing those crabs. We might eventually hatch that and see what we got. Um, not really too eager to do that so it, I'm not entirely sure when we will level that up but we'll wait we'll wait on it that's all I can say for now oh there's the boss all right go ahead and knock that out let's see honestly this boss is pretty straightforward there's not that many uh, things to dodge except for that Especially after all those crabs at the beginning were knocked out real quick. All these other people, their abilities are pretty cool, honestly. That uh, VIP man, ABC, whoever that is. Uh, dual wielder, that's what he's using. That's pretty awesome, all the abilities he's doing. I'm watching him flipping and jumping all over the place. Do a little dodge, get out of that. No need to get stunned and take excess damage unnecessary damage it's just uncalled for jump out bam 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 and finish it off with a slam maybe almost there we go bam look at that first little world boss dead we're gonna go with the gold chest and look at that we got a green item again no doubt let's see where it is level 10 let's equip it Voila, and then next up we're gonna go here, we're gonna start that, and do the next dungeon, and knock this out. We only have three more quests, it's this dungeon, one dungeon after that, and then we go to the next world. And that's, that's it for the first world, aside from the side quests that we, we could go back and do later on. We can go back and, you know, just try and get the side quests knocked out extra stuff I mean honestly it's pretty uh pretty simple stuff too like some of them are world bosses other than that like th there's a mount there killing a thousand of the direwolves I am getting attacked by a crab come on crabbies let's just uh try and get through this dungeon as quickly as possible so we can get through the next dungeon as quickly as possible they don't want to become food the crabs are dancing. I like it. It's nice. It's a little crab party. I'm not entirely sure where we are or if we're supposed to be on the map that we were, like, just on. Like, leveling in. Out in the open world and not in a dungeon, but... It, it looks vaguely familiar to it. Just, I don't remember the lighthouse. I know there's boats and stuff, but... I'm sure this is just a different instance world. Oh, we leveled up. Nice. Level 11 now. It's crazy how quickly that's gone. Just gonna release you two and then jump off the plank. No fall damage. We like it, right? It's a little weird, but it works. We're gonna do something a little bold here. And we're gonna pull all 11 mobs that we need to kill to progress. That's what we're gonna do. Including the cabbage. 
which is that dude exploding crap. Come on, buddies. I got a party to attend to. Come on, everyone round up. Circle up. Come on, gather around. Got a story to tell. You all ready? It's called boom and then slash. I'm gonna go ahead and use heal. Oh lord. This ain't good. Oh, shouldn't have been so bold. But don't worry. We still made it in the end. That's all that matters. We're too good. Just too good. Look at that. This Kravage is uh, beefy, to say the least. He has a lot of health. And does a lot of damage. You need to calm down, dude. Jeez, take a chill pill. Alright, we got nine mobs until we can progress again. I I'm not honestly that upset with the mechanics of progressing through the dungeon. I kind of like that. That's honestly pretty cool. Let's see here, volcano crab. Oh, just one? One volcano and a whole bunch of electric crabs? That's, what a combo. Diversity, you know? Doesn't exist. Although I really do like knocking all of them out so quickly. It's just so satisfying. Oh, look at that. We're going up to a castle. Nice. Okay. Cool. Cool. Not too bad. I mean, it looks a little, uh bland but hell oh it's a sand castle look at that jeez <laughs> all right yeah we've all seen that before king crab look at that wonderful we got dent oh we interrupted the party sorry crabs didn't mean to dampen the mood let's just Get all of you friends together. Come on, people. Come on. Yep, all of you. I want every single one of you. You're all invited to my party. My party is the party you want to go to. I promise you that. I'm going to go ahead and use the heal. Just top off ourselves and then go swing around. Knock him out. Yep, that's what we like. Do another flippy flip slam thing and then another slash. Yeah, there we go. Took them all out with ease. You know how it is. Then I guess all we have left to do now is the King Crab himself. Yeah, mission boss, King Crab. Alright, buddy. Oh, look at that. Wow. That's what they were going to do to those humans to steam them. Just like we do to them. Nice. Can't say it's not uh, fair that they do it to us. We do it to them, you know. We are doing not much damage to this guy. That is kind of poopy. This might take a minute. I don't even think that last attack hit, which kind of sucks, because that means I have to press it again. Too much work. Come on, buddy. <clears throat> tired of your fire claws it's not fair how, how, how does that even work how does that work sir I guess it, it's just the tricks of a king huh? king crab I want to get hit by I want to be hit by as little of his abilities as I can possibly manage because I mean honestly they're all pretty easy to miss but I'm just not missing any of them except for that jump that jumps easy it's the fire fire clips you even when it's not supposed to like that see I mean I get I was standing in his claw but I wasn't in the fire There, I didn't get hit. Surprisingly enough. 
He's almost dead. Come on, dude. I want to be done with fighting you. Oh, just stay in front of his face so you won't get hit by the fire. Well, that's nice to know. That. Ah, yeah, nice. He didn't even get to finish his ability. That's what I'm talking about. There we go. Look at that. Dungeon done. And claim the next is just the last dungeon, the Grave Tower Dungeon, and then we move on to the next world. We can also unlock another class if we want. Ooh, purple. I like purple. That's a four star. And it's a weapon. Look at that. Burn chance and poison. Alright. I like that. I like that reward, I must say. Now for this next dungeon, I do plan on trying to see if I can get a few other people in and see if we can like have a, a prop some proper help because that boss on this next dungeon is really tanky and I don't want to fight a boss for, you know, so long because that just sounds like a lot of inconvenient work. Pet decks. Oh, okay, so this is where we can see what he'll look like. This is where he is now. And that's where he'll be next, so he's going to turn pink. And then after that, he'll either look really cool or just look... Okay. Oh, but Black Flame, that's cool looking. Alright, I don't know. That's a tough choice. That's a tough choice. Uh, let's go ahead and... One, let's complete that and get some... Upgraded armor, because we like that. And then play this dungeon. Let's try and find a party and see if we can get anyone to come with us. I don't know if we're gonna have anyone, but we'll see. Oh, we do. We got two so far. Me and one other person. That seems like that's all we're gonna get, but you know what? It'll work. That's all I wanted was just one extra bit of help. Name's Ultimate 77. Alright, Ultimate 77. Where are ya? There he is. Level 19. Yeah, it's boring. Uh, a boar as well. A boar wolf. Named Boome. Alright then. Now these dudes fear you with their ability, and it makes you not able to use your abilities just like that. And that's really inconvenient. I won't lie. It also looks like... Uh, Ultimate 77 is a guardian as well. Yes, he is indeed. Maybe not? No, he's not. I take that back. I'm confused as to what he is doing. But you know what? I'm going to just round all these up. Come on, dudes. They don't hurt too, too bad. Like, not bad enough to kill me instantaneously. Or, like, yeah, instantaneously. I believe that's proper. I'm not entirely sure. Don't quote me on it. But we're going to knock this out pretty quick with this dude's help. It shouldn't take all too long at all. Come on, ghoul knights. We're just going to round you up with all of these uh, dark unicorns, I guess. Spirit horse. I missed that completely. That sucks. Didn't miss it that time, though. Ooh, a big chunk of health, huh? Alright. Onwards. Bam, 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 bam. That's what I'm talking about. Ouch. Ouch. Help me. There we go. That's what I like. I like when they die and not me. This dude doesn't seem to understand we have to kill all of these dudes. Which I don't get. He's level 20. How does he not understand what's going on yet? He also only has a level 2 boar. Now these dudes heal whenever they hit you. And that's 
extremely annoying. Seems like he's good enough to counter it, though, so there's that. I can't solo him. If I were a ranged character, I could, but since I'm melee, I don't do enough damage to just preserve, like, brute force through his healing. Oh, I always like seeing the food pop up. Honestly, makes me hungry. I like seeing the gold, too. I'm not entirely sure what the gold is good for. But, uh, I mean, I like money, so I'm gonna I'm just assume that I like the gold and what it can get me. I'm not entirely sure what that might be. No, don't hit me. Dang it. Dude, I can't do it. I'll just wait. He'll catch up. Yeah. Alright, just these last three mobs and then the boss. Tree guardians are beefy. That's for sure. Alright, look at that. On to the boss fight, right? Maybe not yet. No, not yet. We're getting close. It's coming around the, the corners. There's a few more, so I'm not just going to say the singular corner. Ah, fear. At least it's not too long. Just four seconds. That's not horrible. It's very doable. No. So whenever they're glowing, it's, there's every two hits they can apply fear. That's all it needed. All right, toxic sludge. Oh, they're cute. Just making some quick work of these dudes. I'm gonna go ahead and run over here and pull all of these because I want to get there and be done quicker. I want my I want my loot. Oh no, fear. That's no good. There we go. That's some good. Oh, but almost dying is no good. There we go. All right, we're good now. Everything's all right. We're perfectly fine. There was nothing bad happening whatsoever. I wasn't stressed. I wasn't I wasn't thinking I was about to die, no. That's all you. You assumed that. Get some food for the animal. And I got feared. Wonderful. And again. I think he just got feared a few times. Yeah, he did. There's no way in hell he didn't. There we go. Look at that. Beautiful. It was so smooth. Didn't make any mess ups. No one got feared. No one couldn't use abilities. Didn't take longer than it should have. Alright. Now time for Big Clunkard himself. Big old beard and all. Come here, buddy. It's time to die. Face plants. Alright then. No. I don't want none. Whoa. Whoa. What's going on? I better do a lot of damage to him. I like when he falls. But I don't like how little damage he's taking. It's very inconvenient that he's like getting barely touched when I hit him. Like that's aggra that's aggravating.
just die. Die quicker. I was about to say there's still a second stage, too. Alright, buddies. Come on. Let's circle. Let's, let's do a group huddle. Oh, I got feared immediately. No doubt. I'm gonna wait till the fear falls off. Heal up. And then... Just do a little smack. And then a bigger smack. And then a jump back. And then more smackage. And another big smack. And then jump back. And I got feared, so I'm just gonna whack him. There we go. Now for the tree pillar. Oh, that takes no damage whatsoever. Thanks, dude. Helps out a lot. Still got one more. Then we can finish off the boss. What is he doing? Dude, we can't fight him yet. There's another one. Yeah, now he sees me. Now he sees me. No, don't hit me. Rude. I don't hit you. I mean, well, I take that back. I do hit them. Now the boss is free, and that is something I want to avoid. Leave me alone, big purple ball. I don't want to deal with you. I don't understand why he's running from the boss. He hasn't been taking any damage. He's like eight levels higher than the boss. Like, come on, grow. Do something, dude. Stop kiting him. Oh, I'm getting feared. Alright, there's the damage. Got feared again. Oh. Nothing but fears. It's almost dead, though. So that's nice. There we go. Dunzo. That's what we like to see. That is definitely what we like to see. Alright. Pick our chest. Let's do the purple one this time. It's orange. I think that's... Look at that. Five star. Holy crap. Perk three mob boss. I wonder what that means. We'll, we'll check it out. Return to town alone. I don't want him to follow me. It's not a part of it. He's no one I care about. Let's check out. Uh, let's check out our new weapon. Look at that thing. That's nice. I like that. Now, I guess off to, what is this? Go to world two by using the teleporter. That looks like the teleporter. Not whatever was over there. World two, level 15 required. All right, we gotta get one more level. We just need like 21%. There's a boss coming up. I might just run over there and do that. Um, yeah, so we're just going to run over there real quick. I will see you guys once we get to the boss. And we'll get level 15, go to the second world, and we'll be great. That's just what's going to happen. Alright, we're almost at the boss. I see some players running around. I hope the boss is still alive. Uh, it doesn't look like he is. It looks like he just died because they're running away. That's a little crappy. I was hoping to kill him for experience, but I guess I can't do that anymore. So what I'm just going to do is I'm going to grind out some of these uh, level 10 C. I give me 1% each kill. So I'll have to kill 30 or er, 30 people. That's uh, a little discouraging, but well, that one gave me two. Okay, that sh shouldn't take too long. I'll just catch you guys back whenever... We hit level 15 and can go into the next world. Oh, alright. Crab Prince. We'll do that. Now we just gotta wait for him to spawn. And hopefully that will push us up to level 15. Um, if not, uh, we could just kill six more... 
boar wolves. Get that. And go for that. That'll definitely push us up to 15. For sure. If this doesn't. But yeah, so we'll just, I'll catch you guys back whenever he spawns, and we'll go from there. Alright, the boss is just about to spawn, so here we go. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Not the, the best start, but that's alright, we're recovering. We got a lot of people here anyways, so he's gonna last no time at all. Look at that, he's already dead. Practically. If I can uh, get up off my ass. Did not push us up to level 15, which sucks. So we're just gonna go the easy way. And, uh, yeah, just get it that way. Gonna go ahead and equip that, because it's an upgrade anyways. Sad as it is, having to downgrade. It's just... Now it just looks like we just started. This is the same stuff that our starter character was in. Or maybe it was green. I don't know, I can't really remember. I think I have it. Maybe? Yeah, it's blue. That's exactly what we started with. But anyways, uh, we're gonna go over there and kill six boars and get to the next location. It shouldn't take but a few seconds, hopefully. I mean, the boars are pretty, uh, pretty clustered over here, so that, that definitely helps. There's one. Alright. Come here. Two hit. That's wonderful. It's take no time at all. Bam. And we just need, what, two more? One, two, no, three more. Yeah, we need three more. Now we need two more. Here, boars. Come here, boars. Right here. One, two. Swamp, swamp, swamp. There we go. Claim. And a level up. Beautiful. Now, what we're gonna do is, I guess, get to that waystone and teleport back to the town. And continue on to world two. We'll probably leave it off there, honestly. That I think we've... we've accomplished a lot so far we've upgraded quite a bit we even have a very nice weapon very happy about that um so in the next episode we will definitely check out world 2 and explore throughout that world because that's exciting but real quick i want to take the food we do have and cram it down borington's throat real quick see if we can actually get him to level four hopefully that doesn't look like we're going to be able to sadly but we'll get him close that's what matters so next episode we'll definitely be able to get him to level four that'll be exciting to see him in his i think it was the pink form teleport there we go Look at that. Our next quest will be defeat three, 35 Quillodiles. That'll be uh, tons of fun, I'm sure. But once everything loads in, that is going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. This is honestly quite a cool game for it trying to be an MMO. It's come very close and accomplished that if not. I definitely suggest trying this game. It is a lot of fun. When I was playing alone, I enjoyed it a lot. Definitely enjoyed it as, now as well. So definitely check it out. Uh, I will leave a link in the description to the game itself. So you guys, if you want to check it out, you can just click that down below and play it for yourself. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Please leave a like and subscribe. Don't forget to comment down below as well. Um, and thank you guys for watching. I know I said that already like three or four times maybe, but remember, shine bright, neon bright.